Hey, what's up, Tunday and everybody at Kingdom Content? My name is Jose, and today I'm going to give you guys some tips on uh, how to bring in more traffic through your website organically. That way you don't have to pay for ads, uh, Yelp for leads, because Yelp shares the leads with like five other companies anyways. So let's get started. Okay, so the first tip I have for you guys is content. Okay, and by content, I mean everything here on your website that is in blue. This is what Google reads when it crawls your website. So what you want to do is fill all this blue, which is your text and your pictures, fill it with keywords. And by keywords, I mean the, the words that people are typing into Google when searching for your services. So see this uh, crown right here when I go to save as? It's saved as a crown. So when Google crawls it, that's what it's reading. So instead of that, you want to take that crown off of your website, save it as a keyword like web development Dallas, and, and uh, then re upload the picture with the new word that it's saved under. So that way, uh, when people type that word web development Dallas into Google, Google will crawl your website and say, hey, these guys have it, start springing. Um, so then you start ranking for that word. And also, uh, I suggest you get about 1,000 to 1,500 words on your front page. That way you can uh, fit more keywords in there. And again, Google and the search engines love, love, love content. So I cannot emphasize that enough. Okay, so what I did is I pulled up some of your competitors there in Dallas. I pulled up some regular de web development guys. As you can see, and then I pulled up some Christian ones as well. So uh, uh, we can look at their keywords, and if they're different, then we can target both Christian businesses and uh, just regular people that want a website. So let's take a look real quick. I pulled your website into this tool that I have called Arabs, A-H-R-E-F-S dot com. And what this allows me to do is look at your stats of your website, see? This is the back end of your of your website, and you're only being found for two keywords. So let's take a look at them. Okay, only one. When people type in content core, I guess that's the only one, but you're not being found for it. So you're not being found for any of them because you're in the 75th position for that word, which means you're like on the eighth page of, of Google. Now take a look at your competitors real quick. Okay, so they have 743 keywords that they're being found for so let's check that out line them up in order from first position to last okay so you want to be in the first to tenth position because that's still the fr front page of of google if you're in the tenth position you're at the front page but you're at the bottom of the page okay so website development dallas there's 40 searches a month for that word they're in the first position dallas website de development 50 searches a month Dallas web development 200 searches a month first position uh, web designer Dallas 80 searches a, searches a month first position so as you can see just right here there's already what two or three hundred four hundred searches uh, a month and uh, these guys are getting a good portion of those searches Dallas website de design 150 Website Design Dallas, uh, 150. See, so so there's all these words are different. Each word you can rank for differently as well. So just in this front page, and, and these guys are still in the first position. So they're ranking for a lot more words still, 150, 100, 200. There's already thousands of searches. By not having, by by you not ranking for these words, you're missing out on hundreds and hundreds of uh, potential clients on on all these searches so i really really highly recommend you get that content on your front page and uh and get get all those keywords in there okay optimize every image on your whole website as well okay so these are the other competitors uh, as well 675 keywords here's some of the these christian ones and I found a few specific Christian keywords. Let's see if we can get there. Yeah, see, they have 159. 
So, and there's a there's a few. I think they're only ranking for like two Christian words. So, there's not too many searches for that. But see, this is this is your guys' stats. This is the strength. This right here this is the front page strength of your website, and this DR is your overall website strength. And then here's your competitors. Okay, and the way you get strength to your website is through backlinks. What a backlink is is a link on somebody else's website that points back to yours. So you want to have backlinks on strong websites. That way they can pass some of their power back to you and bring your scores up. Okay, there's a lot of there's there's different quality backlinks, and you want to get uh, you want to go after some high quality backlinks. The cool thing about this tool is that it allows me to go into your competitors and look at all the high powered backlinks because I checked them out and they have a lot of spammy ones as well. But although they have good backlinks, there there are some very, very powerful ones out there that will help you as well. So now for the third tip is the map pack here. Okay, when I when I typed in uh Christian web development, you guys didn't show up, but maybe web development Dallas. Let's see. Okay, so you guys still aren't showing up. The way you can start uh, outranking these these people on on the GMB is by getting citations. What a citation is is whenever you list your business name, phone number, and address on an online directory like Yelp.com or YellowPages.com, then that gets you a citation. So you you want to find out how many your competitors have, and there's some tools that allow you to do that. Uh, you want to find out how many citations they have and get about 20 or 30 more citations than they have. Okay, and, and you don't want to go too much because then you're going to raise, raise red flags in front of Google's eyes. Uh, so uh, 20 or 30 citations and you're golden. Okay, so those are the three tips I wanted to give you guys. First of all, uh, get some content on your front page, 1,000 to 1,500 words. And for every one of your services or service pages, uh, 750 words filled with keywords as well and number two you want to get some backlinks to start bringing in power to your website and that'll also start helping you rank in Google's eyes and number three get those citations so you can start out ranking everybody here in the in the map pack so those were the three tips I wanted to give you guys uh, if you guys need any help feel free to reach out to me my name is Jose with SEO monster design and my number is 806-268-7118. You guys have a good one and God bless.